Yeah. And this weather is great that we're having. Yes. Isn't it beautiful? It's like we're living. It's like we're living on the worldwide internet with our friends in Nevada, Las Vegas. It's so warm here mm -hmm. in New England. It's unbelievable here in the city of Cambridge. It is warm, my friends, on the worldwide internet that are watching in Nevada, Las Vegas. My favorite town. Send me some tickets. I want to come out there soon. Hey, you know, that's just a beautiful area. And I feel like I'm in Nevada right now. Uh-huh. I'm and unbelievable. This is already the beginning of winter, right? Yeah, and we're getting this kind of weather. We're getting autumn weather here in November, uh, 11 days maybe away from Thanksgiving. Uh-huh. My favorite holiday, Thanksgiving. Oh, you like uh, Thanksgiving. Uh, Mr. Really C, what do you do on Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving. Well, I... How do you celebrate Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving. Being a beautiful Asian woman. How do, how do the <laughs> Asians, the majority of the Asians, celebrate Thanksgiving? <laughs> well, I think maybe just join uh, some uh, friends here and their parties. Yeah, we don't really have any ideas to, uh, like, uh, Deep, uh, to prepare any uh, parties, activities, but uh, with your join, like me, maybe I will join like uh, uh, Tony's party, <laughs> something yeah. like that. Yeah. 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 So you but enjoy it, your it, friends' it, party. Yeah, yeah, friends' party, and then yeah. the Thanksgiving mm -hmm. is like, um, it's my holiday, it's yeah. my vacation. Mm -hmm. It's like uh, I'm so the first term. So first term mm -hmm. is going to finish. So you go yeah. to so you go to Tony's party, yeah. and um, and uh, what what's the party consist of? Since it doesn't consist of a turkey, what type of foods <laughs> and what kind of party works are there? Well, I mean, because I'm interested <laughs> in about Tony's parties. Maybe I want to come one day. So tell me about Tony's party. Tony's party. Yeah. Uh, I don't really have any idea so far. Maybe it's kind of a surprise party again. Oh, okay, okay. I think. I saw one surprise party through surprise. for you, your birthday party, which was very <laughs> huge. So I could imagine a private uh, party sort of like that, what, 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 what it would consist of. In uh, the daily life, we really need some mm -hmm. kind of a surprise, right? Surprise right, right. to make you happy. <laughs> oh, beautiful, beautiful thing. Good, like good to have good friends like that. Right, right. You know, you look so stunning as always. Oh, Unbelievable. You. Isn't she beautiful? She is gorgeous. You know, I can't wait to come in here and do the show, you know, scope. Mm -hmm. Hey, hi to my friends again on the world, watching and listening on the worldwide internet, yep. Cambridge Community Reality Radio. We welcome you. And my friends, too, here in the greatest city in the world, which is Cambridge. Hi, how you doing? Yeah, yeah. All my good friends yeah, out there. Hello, everyone. This is Jintiao Dian Shitai, the CCTV, the radio program. Hello, everyone. Can you tell us how to say hello? That's beautiful. I love you. Yeah. So talking Mandarin, right? <laughs> yeah. To all my beautiful Asian friends out there. Unbelievable. That's, that's great. You know, MIT, Harvard there. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. I mean, you know, you see them all over. The community so large. The, the Asian community population here in Cambridge mm -hmm. is really growing. Oh, Gro that's the true. growth of that of, of the Asian community is unbelievable the way it's happening right now. Well, how do you feel? I mean I think no, it's fantastic. It's I think like quite <laughs> you are you going to make something like a really interesting? Like uh, yeah, I'm gonna. Face? But you know, the, 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 gro the, the growth, the growth, the growth of uh, of Cambridge and the Asian community. And forget about my face, but the growth <laughs> of the Cambridge community is unbelievable. I know, I'm beautiful. How you doing? <laughs> but you know, it's great. The community is unreal. It's like you have the community where the growth is, and you see them getting involved in politics. And especially in the education system, they're making a difference. And soon you'll see members on the school committee as well uh -huh. as the city council because they're very proactive. I see that. I see a lot of the politicians just before election took place. I've seen a lot of the politicians walking with uh, prominent people here in the uh, Cambridge community of Asian descent. It's just a beautiful thing. But I welcome Indian summer. I know you guys too as well. This is. A, Beautiful weather. You feel so good. You feel so vibrant, vigorous. You the, the vigor. And, and sunshine, sunshine, sunny, ooh. sunny, and fresh. It's really fresh. Oh, wow, mm. I feel so. Ooh, 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 I feel fresh, so good. Nice, shiny. Mm -hmm. It really makes you happy. Oh yeah. Oh no, 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 no question about it. Because the day, the days are shorter. Uh -huh. We lose an hour in time, so it gets darker at 4:30, mm -hmm. and then you know the cold, the cold comes in when the winter's going to kick in eventually, and then it's so cold and everything. And the weather now is looks so. Uh, it's, uh, it's kind of like, uh, it's not regular. Like it's not normal. Do you remember? Well, it's been in, normal the last three or four years. It's been just like this. But you, do you remember in in, in auto, uh, October, mm -hmm. the, the big storm, snowstorm, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. and I mean, is there any like case before in your experience in, in your life before a, a big storming, a big snowstorming oh, October like last, in what? October? Mm -hmm. uh, and it happened there before. No, really. I don't no, remember, really, I don't remember right? October. My, my, yeah, my, my my professor, she says that she never, 
she never experienced that no, before. No, not October. In, in both, both Maybe days. November before Thanksgiving. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe just before Thanksgiving around this time. Yeah. But with the global warming taking place, I actually believe right. that's happening. The climate's changing, the Earth's warming, the atmosphere's changing, and therefore places that were cold yeah. at this time of the year yeah. are now having uh, experiencing 55 to 60 degree weather mm -hmm. at this time, which is abnormal, like yeah. you said, very abnormal, but I love it. You love it? I, doesn't, mm -hmm. I hope it doesn't mean that earthquakes fall well, and, earthquake. and hurricanes and stuff but like that, you know? Because, yeah, As the earth warms. Besides, but but that's uh, regarding to the same level rising. Oh, yeah. And then did you ever heard the news? Did you ever hear the news from Bangkok? And the city was flooded. Oh, under the water. city, yeah, under the water. Yeah, that's, what, that, that is that's, not, good. that's not good. That's not good. That's not good at all. I yeah. mean, the water rises, the sea level. That's why over in China they're building, um, they're actually filling in the ocean and building small cities. Oh. I mean, to them, they're huge cities. I mean, they're building because the population mm -hmm. is, is, is growing and booming so much. They need, to, they need to develop more land, so they're filling in the water and building cities. Right. And I, I fear the same thing over there. Oh. What if the sea rises and those people who live in oh, that, yeah. that fill in city, uh, wow. Flooded. Flooded. <laughs> it could be tragic, you know? Flooded, tragic. It could be tragic. tragic. It yeah, could be tragic. tragic. That's right. one thing. It's great to have that advancement and move on, that technology and the ability to build on the water. Mm. But then you got a question, like you said, like in Bangkok, just the sea level rising. Mm. What happens to those who are living below sea level? You know what? Like, actually, like Bangkok, mm -hmm. uh, regarding to the export study, studies right mm. actually uh, initially Bangkok like this is the sea level and then uh, this is Bangkok right it's like uh, nearly equal to the okay. sea level but because like uh, human activities right. the human like they build the buildings underground and then they they suck some water out out of from the underground, so the underground has no water, no enough water. That's why the ground uh, goes goes down, and then the the global warming and the sea level rise. Yeah, rise right this way. I mean, maybe this this much, mm -hmm. this much. Yeah. So the sea like, comes back where yeah, it yeah, the yeah, sea comes back to where yeah, it once lived. Yeah, yeah, something like mm -hmm. this. That's why the city was full of water now. So that's, Unbelievable. That's, yeah. It's just crazy. I mean, in your analogy there, just showing in the, with your hands there, um, um, letting people know at home no. about the different levels and how it was once water, then they cleared mm -hmm. it out, and then now you just get filled in land, mm -hmm. and then all of a sudden the water wants to come home. There's a problem. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It's like a fish. You want to go back home, oh. <laughs> but there may be a problem when you go back home. Yeah. I mean, it's not a good no, problem either. No, it could be very, should. very tragic yeah, problem. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I'd like to too say thank you to all my friends right. supporting us and hitting us up on YouTube too right. at CCTV Cambridge Scope. CCTV Cambridge right. Scope keywords, or else if you want to choose my name, Clyde Hicks, C L Y D E H I C K S, I'll go to CCTV Cambridge Scope, whatever you feel, whatever you yeah, CCTV, choose to do. You yeah, know? CCTV Cambridge. So you got two different ways to go. Right, that's right. Right, that's and then yeah, you got CCR Cambridge at gmail.com if you want to send Gmail. Yeah. I'll go to Facebook as well. Yeah. And I thank you for all your support and everything right. because we need your support without you guys. This is nothing like like without this vehicle. I mean, we could do this on the street without the cameras, everything. I don't think it will be as big as a hit. I love we love being in your house, in your laptops. You could be watching in your bedroom right now. You're not out of bed yet, you lazy thing. Or maybe you're in a different time zone and you're actually in bed. And you're in your pajamas and you're enjoying the show. It's beautiful. I think it's a beautiful thing, don't you? That's the world of communications. You could actually be in your pajamas. We're dressed because it's actually like 10:15 in the morning here in Cambridge on the East Coast, and, and, and you could be in the Midwest, it could be, you, still, you may still be just getting up or brushing your teeth and, and listening on your laptop or on your television, you got it like that, you're tied in to your, to your local cable station, and you know, I don't know, how, whatever, how you're listening, you know, there's different ways to go with the social network, it gives you different directions, it's unreal. And uh, it's just a beautiful thing, isn't it? And we come to you like that, I love it like that. You know, I just like to get a Gmail or an email from someone and say, look, Clyde, but with me and my wife, we're laying in bed, we're listening to you and Miss Sissy, we love it. We wish you would just shut up and let Sissy talk more. And this is what I'm trying to do. I'm, I've been trying to do that all the time. Even when I call her on the phone, I talk all the time. She gets bullshit, she gets BS, and then she gets real strong with me and she hangs up on me. She really does. 
Because you get stuck, Clyde, you never talk. And you're on the set, you talk. I said, look, you know, this is how it goes. I mean, I can't help it. I get the tongues, I roll. I said, just just step in. I said, slap me and just tell me to shut up. Like she was okay, talking about you know what? Like, Look, I really want to hear the, No, people like, I, I, mm-hmm. today I came uh, by train, right? I didn't mm-hmm. drive today in the morning. It was too rush. Mm-hmm. So like uh, on the subway, I really heard uh, people talking about the, the big news, which is about the pain stage. Mm-hmm. Uh, scandal news. Right, right, right. So, it so was huge. I mean, do you, ha- you have any idea about that oh, issue, the event? Sad, sad. Yeah, yeah. Prolific, maybe the most tragic, mm-hmm. horrible, right. uh, indecent um, story mm-hmm. in, the, uh, in, the, in, the, in the history of America. Mm-hmm. I mean, in terms of what happens. Now, I want to set the stage because Miss Sissy brought it up, and, it, and it's been a hot topic. Last week, it started last Monday, I believe the story was broke when we were on the air. Right. But we had different topics we were talking about. We had no idea about this story, this huge story, which may be so historical in a negative way in America, of a happening like this taking place in America, mm-hmm. which is amazing, in America. And when there's millions of women, there's thousands, hundreds of women, right now as me and Miss Sissy talk mm-hmm. in Africa being raped, and being violated and this happens here in America 2012 and it may be over a 30 year period that this um, tyrant this it's this it's a uh, it's this individual who mm-hmm. I can say some lousy things about it I can think of the worst names to call this individual mm-hmm. but but I'm not gonna go there mm-hmm. I'm just gonna let the story speak for itself and we're gonna play a little segment just to get you into what you know how everything took place and how long a period and how the story actually began and started steamrolling and uh, and how it all came so for real and how so many hearts were, were, were broken, families were broken and people were violated. But we're, we're just going to let the story speak for itself. Done by uh, Mad, Mad Dog Mike on, 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 on Mike in the Morning in, in the great city of New York City, the Big Apple. And uh, Mike did a lot of research on this, what Miss Sissy brought up. So stupidly we wanted to move into I didn't want to get into it right away, but we're gonna get into it. I'm gonna let the audio and the visual speak for itself. Let right. Mike tell the story. But like Clive, like before the, we mm-hmm. before we showed that this this research, like I just have a question, like Penn State University, is that a pin what the full name of this university? Uh, Pennsylvania State University is one of the largest universities in the country. And uh, it's what you call uh, uh, one of the one of the most prestigious. Part two, featuring the platinum band, and this time we're gonna get funky. funky. Talks of my Asian persuasion. 